Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. And if you're new, welcome to my channel. I'm super excited today because we have my Sephora haul. This is from the spring VIB sale. Um, it is going on from the, I want to say 9th to the 19th. Yes, I believe so. Yes, the 9th to the 19th. And so this isn't my only order coming in. I actually have, um, Two more orders coming in but this is the bulk of the makeup and the other ones I will share once they come in but I really wanted to get this video up and show you all these goodies I actually have other stuff from other brands as well I figured I'd throw it into an, this haul just to have like a collective haul video so I'll show you everything that I got but first we're gonna start off with Sephora so the first item that I was so excited to try is actually the grande lash serum so this is a lash serum that it's created with a blend of vitamins, peptides, and amino acids. This serum gives you the appearance of longer, thicker looking lashes in eight weeks with full improvement in four months. It's a favorite for helping to enhance short, thinning, or brittle lashes, which I don't have short, thinning, or brittle lashes, but I really wanted to try this just to see if I can grow my lashes even more. They already are long, but I wanted to try this to see if it could help grow them even longer. And it just comes with a itty bitty wand. And it just has the serum on it. You just dip it in, one swipe, one swipe, and that's pretty much it. So I'm excited to see what the results will be with this. And you guys will see it in a future favorites video if it works. Next up, I got these two items from One Size. I wanted to get um, Patrick Star's new powder foundation, and I also picked up the puff. So the puff, you just have the little One Size, and that's what that looks like there. And then the foundation. in this really pretty red packaging and I love it because for those of you that have nails which he mentioned in his video it has these little tabs to open it and it's got a magnetic closure but that is the product right there I got the shade light three so hopefully this will work on my skin very very excited to try this and then I also got uh, Patrick Star's primer. I've been really enjoying his brand. Honestly, I really, really have. I love the meaning behind it, how it is one size and how there's no size or no image to wearing makeup because it's true, right? Like you don't have to be a certain size to wear makeup. So I really do like the meaning behind his brand. And that is the primer right there. I'm really, really excited. I just want to do like a little swatch on my hand. Okay, so it seems like a, um, like a tacky pore filling kind of primer, I would say. Not really too much scent to it, which I can appreciate. So I definitely will have that in a testing out new makeup video coming soon. Then I got two blushes from MAC because MAC does sell in Sephora Canada, which I am so happy. So I got two of their powder blushes. So I got the shade in, uh, does it say on the powder packaging? No, no. Anyways, it is Fleur Power. It's a satin blush. And that is the color right there. So it is more of a pinky coral blush. We'll do a swatch. So this is Fleur Power. And then I also got the shade Pinch Me, which this is, I think, a pretty popular shade. It's kind of like that burnt orange 
much more pigmented. So that is Fleur Power, or yeah, Fleur Power, and then Pinch Me is right there. Then next I got the Unseen Sunscreen from Supergoop. So I've been wanting to try this for a long time. This brand is all the rave on YouTube and Instagram. And this one is apparently made for oily skin. So I'm really, really excited to try this out. So when you look at the product though, it's like clear. Like I don't know if you guys will be able to see that consistency kind of reminds me of like I don't know like a silicone primer or it is quite illuminating but we'll see we'll see I've heard that this one is the best one for oily skin and I needed a sunscreen for the summer so I'll be excited to try that one out and then the last product that I got other than the two samples I got the Valentino Donna Born in Roma travel spray. So I did smell this and I loved it so much that I got the full size. But that's okay, I'll be able to keep this one in my purse. Look at the packaging, how cute it is. It smells so good. I would say it's like a floral. So on Sephora's website, it says that it is in the fragrance family of florals. So it's warm florals. So the keynotes are black currant, a jasmine, grandi florum. Yeah, grandi florum and bourbon vanilla. Hmm. Really, really, really love the smell. It is more of a mature smell, but oh, I can't get enough of it. I just love it so much. And then these are the two like, samples that I got, like the 100 perks. So I got the Makeup Forever Shine Control Step 1 Primer. I'll open that up to show you. you know, actually, it's a decent size little tester. Happy about that. And then I got the Murad Acne Control Clarifying Cleanser. And this too is a decent size. Cool, I'll be able to use that today when I take off my makeup. So that is really nice actually. I'm really excited for these products. Like, I've been wanting to test them out and I always wait to try newer products. I didn't really need any skincare refills this time around. So I figured I'd get a couple products that I've been wanting to try. I did need a new sunscreen, so figured that I would get that. So that is all the products that I got from the Sephora VIB sale in this package. So next I did place an order from the Juvia's Place website and I decided to try three of their eyeshadow palettes. So I got the Nubian by Juvia's Place. So the Nubian palette, which that is the outer packaging. And then this one is like a, it's, they're all neutrals, but this one is more of like a brownie neutral palette. I've heard really good things about their palette, so I really wanted to try it. Then I got the Warrior, which I've heard tons of good things about. And this one is the bigger eyeshadow pans. Again, it's all around the same tones, but you know me, I'm a neutral girl. So that is the palette right there. Let me know if you want a testing out new makeup. And if so, I can feature these palettes in a video or multiple videos. Then I got the Nubian 3 Coral. So I love coral tones, as you can see. My eye look today, which I also filmed, but I believe it will be up after this video. So this is the Coral palette. So I'm really excited to test those out. I really do. I've really heard a lot of good things about Juvia's Place, so I've been excited to test out their products. Next up, I finally made the purchase for the Laura Lee Nudie Patootie Palette. This one I've wanted for over a year, and I finally bit the bullet and did it. So this is what the outer packaging looks like. Super, super pretty. And then you open it up. And it's got a nice mirror, but that is the inner portion of the palette. 
it is again a nude palette obviously nudie patootie but i've wanted this for so long it has a lot of mauves and a lot of browns and the shimmers look phenomenal so i'm really excited to do some eyeshadow looks with this one so again let me know if you'd like to see that and i placed a mini order with mellow cosmetics so i got a lipstick from them in the shade nude i can do a swatch of this for you guys so it is just that pinky rosy tone that you guys know that i love and then i got a quad palette that the name is rhea and this too looks really pretty it reminded me of like the charlotte tilbury quads so we'll see how good it does i'll i'll do a video using this and it's just it's a good travel palette if you don't really want too much variety in your eyeshadows which i mean if you're just going away for a weekend or something it's definitely a good to have and i like these little mini palettes so i can never say no to a mini and this is the package that i'm the most excited about that i just picked up and there may or may not be a giveaway in my next video when i do a testing out this product so this is the samantha march and ofra collaboration i have pages falling out but I got the PR box. I didn't get this sent to me. I wish. I wish I could be on Oprah's PR. But no. <laughs> but I bought this to support my girl, Samantha Marge. If you don't already know, she is one of my favorite YouTubers. So I definitely had to support her collaboration. And it is the Life's a Draft collection. So you've got a personalized note from Samantha. The illustrations on this is amazing. And then you have all the product images here. It's really a cute package. And then all of the products are in here. So in this PR package, you actually get stickers. So you have Aries, her dog, which is right there. Then you have Samantha March. You have a flower. Um, she is a writer as well. She has a bunch of novels and she loves to do like exercises and yoga so it's just a lot of little stickers that represent her so I find that really cute then you get a trio lip gloss collection which has her milli gloss that was in her previous collection so this is the one that i already have then you have a new lip gloss here i'll just open them up so this is the milli lip gloss that we already that she already had with her collection that i already have and love then you have the peony lip gloss which is like a pinky nude tone color with a bunch of sparkles and then queen which is representing her dog aries because she always calls her the queen and this is kind of like a bronze brown shade with glitter in it as well so super excited for those and then this is the star of the show she created an eyeshadow palette actually it's a face palette with them face and eyeshadow so you have eight eyeshadows on the top and then you have a blush a highlight and a bronzer so the bronzer is the same bronzer that she had in her previous collection as well as the blush as well it's just the shimmering part and then this highlight is a brand new highlighter um it's called dream chaser and then you have all the eight eyeshadows which i love purple tones so i will be doing a video coming up using this palette and like i said there may or may not be a giveaway in that video so stay tuned and actually i think that's everything <laughs> yeah that is everything so I'm definitely excited to have all of these products. I can't wait to play with them and do a bunch of videos. So let me know what you want to see in a testing out new makeup video, what you'd like to see first. I'm definitely really excited to dip my hands into all of these beautiful products. And like I said, keep an eye open for the Samantha March video that I will be doing using all of her products. 
and there will be a giveaway in that video so this will be the first giveaway on my channel so i hope that you guys enjoyed this haul so it wasn't only my sephora vib haul but the majority but i definitely wanted to feature all of these other products that I have gotten recently to show you and I hope that you guys enjoyed if you are new here I really do hope that you will subscribe and like this video if you like haul videos definitely don't forget to hit that notification bell if you'd like to be advised when I upload next have a great day guys bye